Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of Persona 3 Reload. Last time we uh, finished the full moon boss, met up with Strega, um, managed to uh, get up to the next barrier point in Tartarus, uh, before we did that actually. We started a new social link with uh, uh, Hayase, the, the track meet rival, uh, or the track competition rival actually. Uh, we continued on with um, the Gourmet King and did some summer school. And we you know, managed to get some more academics on that one. And we have a new addition to the team, a little pupper called Koromaru. So we have a little bit of summer, uh, summer vacation left. Who's over here? Nozomi? Yeah, why not? Hope everyone's doing well today. What's up, bro? There aren't any loss around now, so it's all good. But pretty soon, man, they're going to start coming out of nowhere. I'm sick of doing the same thing over and over. Let's kill all the shadows and finish this. Yeah, I believe we've got three more left, if I'm not mistaken. My son became nocturnal over summer vacation. He wakes up in the afternoon, leaves at night, and usually doesn't come back until sunrise. Where do they go that late at night? That escapade club? The security's just too lax in those kinds of places. I heard they don't even care if a high school student just walks in wearing their uniform. I, I wouldn't know anything about that. Sup, Nozomi? Listen. Perfect timing. Do you want to go get some to eat? I can hear my poor stomach crying sadly. I don't think our bond will grow. That is okay. Yes. <coughs> Not gonna eat that. Mind if I have it? Sure. So next time should be the last because I believe we're link nine with him. Welcome back. It's so hot. I hate this weather. I hate the heat too. How are you holding up, Yuki-kun? Uh, never better. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Sounds like you're making the most of your summer vacation. Let me try to get my mind off the heat. So, the next full moon is in September, right after the break. Ugh, when I talk about it like that, it sounds like I'm preparing for an exam or something. But anyway, there are only four shadows left. We have to hang in there. Four shadows, my mistake. <coughs> Greetings. Summer festival was an excellent experience. The rate at which a candied cotton substance expanded exceeded my expectation. Candied cotton, cotton candy. I would like to make an exception to the next summer festival as well. Expedition to the next summer festival. That makes more sense. Oh, right. Speaking of Koromaro's meals, sometimes he looks like he wants to eat a beef bowl. I guess it'd be better just to give him dog food. I know there are some foods that are dangerous to dogs, and it's not like he needs the stuff for his diet, right? Very true. Hey! Hey, I was thinking, what do you think will happen to us if the dark hour disappears? We'll go back to normal, I would think. Hmm. Yeah, that's what I think too. Those Strega guys said our persona, persona abilities will disappear, so... We'll probably just go back to being ordinary high school students. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> um, hi. We should follow Yuki Chan's advice and try to finish our summer homework soon. Junpei Kun said he's going to do all, his all at once later. How are you going to tackle yours? Uh, little by little. Why, certainly. I think that's the best strategy to do the homework too. That's what I've been doing, so I've gotten most of it out of the way already. Cool stuff. By the way. Mitsuru-san took Aiga-san to the summer festival. I didn't hear anything on the news about it, so no one must have noticed that she's a robot. She must have been in stealth mode. That's exactly what it was. Salut. Um, I don't think she's gonna get any more skills, so... No, thank you. I see. Anyone up here? Yeah. Hmm. 
Looks like there's only educational manga here. Man, I wish they had some shonen stuff. Oh well, at least I have that one I borrowed from what's his name. You want to read it too? It's this baseball manga that finished up a while back. Um, I'll pass for now. Eh, yeah, suit yourself. The series is supposed to be tight as hell, though. Just saying. Uh, because I might want to take Koromaru for a walk. Uh, let's see if there's anything else going on first. What's going on here? Is that Elizabeth? What is Elizabeth? Marvelous. What's up? Ooh, nice. I'm looking Thank forward you. to it. Are you accepting a request? Okay. Wow, we have a lot of new ones. We have a lot of new ones. Okay. Alexi, proof of a bond. Bring me and bring an item that you can only receive when a social link is maxed out. Excellent. Now, let's hear your... So this is proof of one of your bonds. Though it's made out of ordinary material, I can sense some sort of warmth from it. Marvelous. You have nurtured a beautiful bond. A precious, irreplaceable bond. Please take this as your reward. A space badge. Okay. Create a persona that's level 38 or Most more. Excellent. Now. Marionette. Uh, you can now fuse Neboros, the necromancer from hell. Nice. Okay. I wish to become a straw millionaire. Bring what you get after bartering items. What? I hear there's a method to acquire wealth to acquire wealthy by Perhaps simply bartering one item for another may continuously. Come a day when you complete the persona compendium. I have no idea what this is. You must know. Have you ever heard of the story about the straw millionaire? It's a story of a man who becomes wealthy after continuously bartering one item for another. I would like to see if such a feat is possible in I real feel quite reality. Motivated. Thus, I've prepared this bandage wrap for you. Please use this bandage wrap as your first bargaining chip and trade it for something satisfactory. By all means. I have no idea. Aujori, Aujiru. Come to think of it. Where does, uh, word has it that the ultimate drink in your world is something called Aujiru. However, the taste is described as super gross. How intriguing indeed. After all, if I'm to drink something, I would like it for it to taste good. Therein lies my request. Would you please look into a, uh, look for a delicious Aujiru for me? I will await a report of success. Attempt a hundred shrine visits. Bring what you see from praying you at the must shrine. Know. Are you aware of a ritual called the Hundred Shrine Visits that supposedly grants visit wishes? I would love to witness the miracle of the gods myself. However, I cannot abandon my duties. So would you please visit the shrine on my behalf? As for my wish, 500 yen bills are extremely rare in your world, yes? Then I'd like to wish for one. By all means. Oh my god. Is that gonna take up like all my afternoons? I'd like to try a home-cooked oh, meal. Yes. Allegedly, something called a home-cooked meal, which possesses a special kind of flavor, exists in your world. I'm curious what it tastes like. Very much so. Could you bring me something with a flavor of this home-cooked meal? It can be either food or beverage. I have no preference. Well then, I'll be looking forward to it. I will await a report of success. Bring me an Otenta Mitsuyo. So it's a By weapon. By all means. Perform King and I fusion spell. Of course. This request is meant to draw up more of your power, the power of the wild card. In order to achieve that, you will need to perform a special fusion. One involving the king of all, uh, Jack Frost, King Frost, and his darling subordinates. It is a rather daunting challenge, but I await your report of success. I will await a report of success. Uh, retrieve the fifth By document. All means. Okay, we got a lot. So the potent medicine I can't bring yet. Uh, because uh, I think I need to be in school for that one. The nurse's office, yeah. Okay, we have a lot. Attempt a hundred shrine. Does it really have to be a hundred shrine visits? Hand over cooking. I've been waiting for you. 
Hmm, it appears you have what I believe to be home-cooked meal. What would you like to give me? Um, yeah, we got a lot. Let's do... Let's do the chicken salad. Oh, my. Ooh, I believe this is the first time I've ever had this. Yet this flavor tastes rather nostalgic. I see. So this is what a home-cooked meal is. I believe now I understand why people crave the taste of home you cooking. You have my thanks. Thank you very much for sharing this culinary delight. Please take this as your reward. A legendary cleaver. Are you accepting a request? Mysterious potato. Potato that I've grown. Come to think of it. By the way, I heard a rumor that a potato that raised with painstaking love and care will develop a mysterious power. I believe you can obtain the proper seeds to grow such potatoes from a shop that deals in plants. Would you please grow and nurture a potato that to verify the authenticity of this? By beans? all means. I think I have. Oh yes. I sense an unusual power emanating from you. Do you perhaps have one of the potatoes you've grown? Uh, Terukacha. Ooh, what a truly bizarre potato! I can sense an unusual power radiating from it. <laughs> I imagine it would make a rather appealing meal. Ha ha! Don't don't be like uh, Ikutsuki. Mm, why give me such a strange How look? Splendid. In any case, the request is now completed. Please take this as your reward. Ergotite shard. Uh, let's see if there's Here anything else new. Requests. No. Okay, so this straw millionaire thing. Um, that's where I gotta start with it. Very well then. So let's just check out the items I got. So space badge. Regenerate three. Restores uh, some HP each turn. Okay. So it's kind of like the one I gave... Um, I think it was Yukari. Cloth used for treating injuries. There may be someone who needs this. Okay. Critical rate up high. A legendary knife known to few but re reared for its incredible cutting ability. Is it this? That reminds me. You know of Club Escapade? I heard through the grapevine that the owner has there has been collecting gemstones as a hobby. Uh. Good grief. What's he even gonna do with them? I could get so much more use out of them. Ah, uh, there I go again. Sorry, I don't mean to complain. What can I do for yes. you today? So you found a new base model? Ah, uh, this will make for a fine piece of equipment. Trade I've got item. some good stuff in stock. Take your time browsing. Look around. Which one? Okay, so Black Sword, we have two of these. What would you like? Nameless Katana, 130. So I have one of these already. I have one of those. What will it be? Oh, we don't have these. Oh no, those I do. So, what will it be? Here. Well, what I have now is actually better. One thirty. Are you sure? No, no, no. So what now? So this is one thirty ninety nine. What I have is better than this. But it does all stats one. This one's better. Fear high. No, I do not want fear. It's been much more pleasant around here recently, and on Port Island in particular. Well, I guess that just shows. What would you like? So this is for Mitsuru. This does less damage. Yeah, this is for Koromaru. There's still so much we don't know about personas. You'll just have to keep testing different things. Orgia duration plus one turn. So I'm guessing that's her theurgy. Like 
Is okay. that all you need? Hope to see you soon. So this is clearly not the right place anyway. Um, let's try escapade real quick. Oh yeah, there was that summer festival, huh? Damn it, I didn't have anyone to go with. Oh well, probably wasn't that great. Welcome. Uh. Why? I saw this outfit at the clothing department that comes in two colors. They both look great. But I know that colors can affect your luck, so I couldn't decide. I'm here to ask Mama which color I should buy. I know there's such a thing as lucky colors, but we're talking about clothes, right? I, well, I think it's best to just choose the clothes you like best. I'm trying to figure out the the bandage thing. I don't know who would trade a bandage. Now you're here. Token of gratitude for the missing housewife left us a short while ago. One. You rescued her, right? I won't ask questions. Just take it. Four emerald. Oh, thanks. Still more. I think of it. Found that missing schoolboy the other day. Tried questioning him, but his answers didn't make any sense. Said some kids saved him from attack by a black thing. I thought they weren't supposed to remember. Uh, once they got out of Tartarus. I'm counting on you. He left a reward with us, so I'll hand it over to you. Oh, ship boost. Thanks. Good to see you. I mean, I'd rather What'd get you bring? money, but... Wanna sell, sell in bulk? Sure. Yeah, sure. It's a deal. Hmm? You finished? Come back yeah. soon. Hmm. Trying to think. <laughs> Woofy say. The TV remote is at Koromaro's feet. I wonder if there's a TV program he wants to watch. Watching TV with Koromaro could help my academics. Woof? Um. Documentary about a wolf pack. I guess this is what Koromara wanted to see. Koromara seems to be mimicking the pack leader. Good copy. Koromaro seems to really like this program. Watching animals live in the wild helped me improve my academics. The program apparently has more episodes in the series. Maybe I'll watch it with Koromaro again whenever I have the time. Maybe it could be more effective. Yeah, unlock some characteristics. Uh, no, don't study. Oh. Let's go here. There's a cop. During summer vacation, this place is so quiet since there aren't any ra students rushing onto the train. I like the quiet. So do I, sir. So do I. Oh, I saw something. Hmm. 
Here's a question for you. Why do you think I'm so reluctant to catch movies at the theater during the summer? Um, summer blockbusters suck. Well, that's some, true sometimes, but it doesn't really have to do with summertime. So then, it's cold inside? You got it. They blast the air conditioner all day in there. I gotta bring a jacket even in this hot summer weather. You okay there, buddy? Let's see what these guys are up to. The beach? She's asking me to go to the beach? How did this happen? Am I really allowed to go? Yeah. He's a sweet guy, but he seems to be holding back. It's like he won't allow himself. He won't allow himself to enjoy life. Even after his friend and I offered to take him to the beach. He just keeps turning us down over and over. He'll never have fun that way. But don't get me wrong. I won't leave him. You guys are made for each other. Got something new for sale? Welcome. Take your time. Look. Ooh. Is this SP? This might be SP. I will buy 99 of them though. No. I'll buy I'll buy five of them. Please come again. Someone down here need something? Yeah, apparently. Fierce looking delinquent. Damn it, this thing's pretty bad. Just my friggin' luck, huh? The hell do you want? Can't you see I'm really not really in the mood to, for talking right now? Wait, what you got there? Bandages? Ha, perfect timing. Can I have them? Don't give them to him. Now give them to him. Thanks, man. Oof, well, that should work for now. Feeling like I owe a punk like you doesn't sit right with me. You're a student, right? Guessing GeckoCon if you're from around here. Here, I'm not thanking you or nothing, but you could take this. I picked it up over at the station. Not like it's worth anything to me anyways. Then why don't you pick it up? Student handbook. Okay. These assholes are just using us to gather info. They think there were some handy dandy tool that'll give them the scoop at any time they ask. There's something wrong with those guys. Okay. Oh, Elizabeth. Good day. Are you accepting a request? Oh. Very well. Then. So now I need to hand in the textbook with something else. A Gekkon student handbook should be returned to its owner. Can't look at it anymore. Um. Is it yours? Oh, oh Makoto-kun. Hey. Um. So. Um. Finish off this link. Hey, um, so about last time, uh, let's go to Hagakure. Restaurant is filled with the familiar smell of fish. My younger brother and I were twins, but not the kind that looked the same. He was the better looking one. Everyone called me the uglier Suimitsu. They always compared me to him. And I can never beat him in anything. There was a time when I used to hit him for no reason. But even then, he still treated me like a brother. Then in middle school, we bought steamed buns. And then he died. Food poisoning. They said the meat was undercooked. Just his bun, though. Not mine. But I couldn't even cry. I actually felt... relieved. I thought... maybe they'll all finally stop laughing at me. Um... That's understandable. Thanks. 
but I know already. I was a terrible brother. At first, I tried to be more like him. I went to cram schools and did martial arts and everything. But I could never be as good, and eventually, I started to feel like people were laughing at me. The only time I feel safe is when I'm eating. All that matters is what's in front of me, and everything else melts away. See? That's what the Gourmet King really is. I only eat to run away from my problems, but if I keep this up, I'll never be able to replace my brother. Will I? Just be yourself. Be myself? Be myself! Is that really how it is? Hmm. I hear you. You're right. I can never be like my brother. We're two different people. How did I miss something so obvious? <laughs> I can be pretty dumb sometimes. Sometimes. Thank you. Really, thank you so much. So Mitsu truly appreciates me. I feel like our relationship is stronger. And with that, we now the, ultimate form. the moon social link is complete. You can now fuse Sendalphon, the deliverer of prayers. Oh, I know this is sudden, but I'm relieving you of your duties as the gourmet king's royal guard. You're fired because you're the new king. All hail Gourmet King the Second! Gourmet. <laughs> the Gourmet License. Alright. The restaurants in the strip mall gave this to me because of how often I eat there. I feel like I've been fake all this time. But one day, I will become the true Gourmet King! I think I'll become a food critic. It'll be my job to eat. I'm going to become a food master. It's a good when idea. I die and go to the afterlife, I can face my brother. And then I can tell him I was the best at something for once in my life. So until I reclaim my crown, you can hang on to it. I may have lost my title, but someday I'll make my grand return as Gourmet King the 3rd. That's my promise to you. And to my little brother. Huh. I've been talking so much about my brother, but... I'm okay. My memories didn't make me sad and hungry this time. Hmm. Oh, wow. I never realized how good the ramen tastes here. How do you not realize that? After assuming to finish bowl after bowl of ramen, I went back to the dorm. That is actually pretty sweet. There's a box on the counter. Purse paper and vanish ball. I forgot what the oh, it's purse you. paper Welcome does. Back. Vanish ball, I think, just makes you invisible to enemies. Or if you're in a fight, it just makes you auto escape. Summer break will be ending in just under two weeks. Of course, fighting shadows takes priority, but don't forget to dedicate time to studying as well. Yes, ma'am. Uh, enables escape from most battles. There you go. And medium chance of dark infant kill to one foe. Oh, okay. Oh, it could ski -kun. Yes, precisely. Koromaru isn't just any old dog. He's a keen member of C's. Please be mindful of what you're feeding him. I mean, don't tell me. It's all fucking Akihiko there. Yes. What is your summer, it? Your summer break next year will likely be in, inundated with studying for entrance exams. So make use of this free time while you have it. Um. I was trying to cook something and kind of messed it up. And Korachan happened to be nearby. So I asked him if he wanted a bite. He was just joking, but he ran away so fast. I mean, it didn't come out right, but I didn't think it was that bad. Um. Let's talk. Uh-huh. 
I know Korachan didn't mean to hurt Yukari-chan's feelings, but I'm sure she's feeling a little down. I'm not sure what to do in this kind of situation. <laughs> oh man, I'm dying here. Yukitan said that the food she made didn't turn out the way she expected, but even Kuromaru ran away from it. How bad does your cooking have to be for that to happen? Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Hi, I'm Trish, with today's installment of Who's Who. Today's subject is a man in his 20s with a sour face. Um, I mean a handsome salary man, though he hides it with his hair. The scar on his forehead is still obvious. I wonder what happened. Next is news. Pain, pain, go away. Anyone up here? Oh, little puppers. He seems apologetic about something. Get the mad bulls. Got 36 of them. Huh? Oh yeah, because I bought the from the food shopping network. Um, what's going on? Okay, so I still gotta find the student this textbook belongs to. Uh, means I gotta talk to everyone. It's a Zuki Arai Sweets mascot, staring at, at something with its big round eyes. Is it this? Whatever. Yeah. Let's make our usual pilgrimage to the Nick Cafe. Don't. It's not right now, anyway. May need to come back during the day. Now that it's on vacation, I get a lot of younger passengers around midnight. People still talk about that revenge website thing, but is it that well known around here? Gonna check the uh, the guy that sells stuff in here real quick. Oh, he's got nothing to have a look, think. please. <laughs> Anyone missing a textbook? Anyone? No? I don't got a lot of time left. Tanaka, are you missing a textbook? Oh, it's you! I believe you're at the peak of adolescence, correct? Then what I have to say might prove very interesting. Naturally, it's free of charge. Seems that President Tanaka wants to talk to me. Sure. Caught your attention, did I? Well, you better listen carefully then. Today's lesson is called, the smaller the dog, the louder the bark. Ain't that the fucking truth? Have you ever wondered what it would be like to see through people's bathing suits at the beach? Is that possible? Oops! Ah, I forgot. You're underage, aren't you? If you're curious, go ask one of your friends. Just not a girl, unless you want to get slapped. Our company ran an ad in uh, adult magazines proposing a special filter for digital cameras. Simply attach it to your camera and voila! Start peeping! Undress them with your camera's eye, it says. It's been selling like hotcakes. In fact, it's our number one seller. Unfortunately, customers have been complaining that it doesn't work. I told my staff to just ignore them. Nowhere does it guarantee that you'll be able to see anything. What are they gonna do? Tell everyone their creepy plan didn't work out? Sorry, bucko. By the way, try to cut back on the donuts and cupcakes, huh? I have an idea for an ad campaign. 
Women would go crazy over a handsome young man in swim trunks. You'd be perfect for the job. Didn't you just say I was underage? President Tanaka seems to trust me. <laughs> the devil businessman. Have you been keeping your promise? You didn't tell anyone, did you? If you go back on your word, I'll edit your face into the most obscene material I can find. All right. Enough with these fucking threats, buddy. This is... I'm... I'm this is getting fucking serious. Like, no, you can't just do that shit. That's fucking, like, libel or slander or something. That's slanderous libel. Elizabeth. Morning. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. One this time, I believe. Please swiftly and safely conduct a search and rescue. Goodbye now. Let me guess, I only have like two days to get them out. Uh, let's go to the first floor. See what's going on here. I'm sorry. The drone was built with some time ago, so the air conditioning unit doesn't work very well. It's usually tolerable, but today I can understand why Yori is griping so much. Why? Damn, it's hot. Why is it so hot inside too? Help! I'm melting. With the burning desire. What is it? What can I do here? I don't have a computer software on me right now, so I can't do anything. Okay. Port Island Station. Another exclamation. Maybe this is the textbook. Man, this bad. Where'd I drop my student handbook? You need something? I'm a little busy now. Hey, wait, that handbook you're holding. Can I see that student handbook? I was just looking for mine. This might be it. It is mine. <sighs> Thanks, you saved me. Oh, yeah, as a thank you. Here, take this. Irresistible catnip. I got this for free when I was shopping at Aohige Pharmacy, but I don't own a cat. Anyway, if, you're, if you have no use for it, just give it to one of the cats at the strip mall. Uh, maybe this cat here? No. Maybe it actually needs to be the next day. Maybe. I don't know why, man, but I think I'm starting to fall for her. What should I do? I can't keep doing nothing. Maybe I should go ahead and talk to her, you know? Maybe. Is this what they call disillusionment? I didn't realize that he was that kind of guy. I'm gonna stop following him. This is just so disappointing. The last thing I need is another guy like him. You say so. On hot days like this, you gotta go to the manga cafe. It's nice and cool, and you can read all the manga you want. They have access to PCs. Uh, they have PCs to access the internet there too. But well, that reminds me. Sometimes I see that weird guy there. He's always banging away on that little laptop of his, muttering to himself. And he's always got that briefcase, too. Is he like a day trader or something? <gasps> More software? Where? Show me. Tell me. I want more stuff! God damn it. Cat loving boy. I tried putting on cat ears, but the cat still won't even look at me. Maybe if I had a cat toy. I don't think I have enough to buy one. Oh, is that a cat toy? Do you have a pet cat? Nope, you can have this. I can? Thanks. I should give you something in exchange. Oh, I know. You can have this cat ear headband. I don't need it anymore. There you go. 
Maybe Elizabeth would like this headband. I should try showing it to her. Let's do that now, so I can get this thing out of the way. And let's see when the deadline is. 9-4. Okay, I have time. I have time. Marvelous. Okay. Thank you. I'm looking forward to it. Are you accepting a request? Wonderful. Seems you've completed a request. Oh my. Oh my, what a what is this delightful item? I cannot resist the urge to put it on. Well, here goes nothing. Meow. <laughs> I see. Wearing this will transform you into a cat in the blink of an eye. You have my thanks. Thank you for this lovely gift. Now I too can be a straw millionaire. Twenty turquoise. That's a lot of turquoise. Let's see if there's Here any new are ones. My requests. Nope. Never Very mind. Well. Okay. So let's go back here and hang out with Hayusei. Oh, I didn't check to see what thing he is. He's a star. I think we have any star personas, do we? We do not. Okay, back to Polonia Mall to the Velvet Room. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Uh, first, let's register Registering all the is overriding except all registered. Do this we is have your any stars? So far. By Arcana. Browse to your heart's content. The Neko Shogun. So these are the DLC ones. I don't want to. I don't want to touch them because they're very overpowered. Um, let's see if I can now, fuse. Let's be well then. Shall we take a look? Setanta. Hanged an Empress. Priestess and Moon. Take all the time you need to consider. Let's do these two. Are you satisfied with this? Yeah. What do you wish to inherit? Um, that one. Oh, four of them. The spirit drain. Diorama. And Rakakuja. Or Rakukaja. It seems you have been blessed with. <laughs> yes. A new power emerges. Skip this. I am Satanta. If anyone dares to bother you, I'll strangle them to death without batting an eye. Oh, it seems the star social link has blessed you with even more power. Cool. Very well. Uh, I can we leave. Good day. Here are my requests. Oh. That was fortuitous. Wonderful. Attack mirror. Nice. Anything else? No. Very well. OK, 
Okay, let's head back to Hayase. Sorry about that, Hayase. I need to create a persona with your arcana. No. Oh? Huh? Wanna grab some chow? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you're down? Alright then. How about we get some ramen, since you're already here and all. Good. If I had the money, I'd get some for mom. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. I get to eat here for free. Not just here, but every restaurant in the strip mall. Damn. They're all supporting me. I'm the only one who can eat as much as I want, wherever I want. But I feel kind of bad, like I'm taking advantage of their kindness, so sometimes I pay the bill anyway. Someday, I'll pay them back for everything. But for now, I gotta take whatever I can get. That's why I have to make it big. It's for everyone who's been helping me. Sounds like a lot of pressure. Well, I'd be lying if I said it wasn't. But a little pressure can be a great motivator. All that matters is how you deal with it. By the way, who would you say is your biggest rival? Myself. True. You can be your own worst enemy, but same time, your greatest ally. You do get it. Hmm. There isn't really anyone left who I want to compete with. The other guys on my team can't even keep up with me. I guess what I'm looking for is a real challenge. Hey, you should think about taking track more seriously. Then we can really push each other. Might even reach new limits together. I say seems seems sees some potential in me. We'll catch each other between training sessions. Later. Later. Part of ways with Hayase and went back to the dorm. Welcome back. Sup, dude. Damn, it's hot. Sweating like a pig over here, man. No. Stay strong, Yori. He will only affect you if you allow it to. Of course, there are limits to that theory. <laughs> You're not going to learn anything new, are you? No. Um. Hi won its victory, 11th victory today. Sorry, Hi won, that threw me off. Hi won its 11th victory, the first in four years. And now another missing persons report. Satsuki Onozuka, 34, a housewife in Minatoku has been reported missing. Police are searching for leads and ask the public for assistance. There's a possibility she may have wandered into Tartarus. We must go rescue her. Nah, she All fucked. Right. Uh, you won't gain new skills. Oh, no. I see. Not now. That reminds me. Did I get my stuff? I have not got my stuff yet. Looks like the produce can be harvested. Cool. Try plant something? Don't plant. Uh, first floor lounge. Anything else going on? No. Hmm. So, she will raise my charm, and right. he will raise my what? Nothing. I see. Well. Or I could just study, raise my academics. I'll work on the charm. Absolutely. Yukari seems to be having fun. We enjoyed watching a DVD together. <laughs> that was fun.
I'm a I'm learning how to adult. Well, we should probably head to bed. Have a good night. You too. Yeesh, this is a scorcher. Oh man, it's already the 20th? Summer break's almost over. Not that I got anything to do. You'd think with special powers, the rest of the world wouldn't be so... boring. Hmm? <sighs> What's she doing? Drawing? She's some kind of caricature artist? Nah, no way. There's no one around for her to draw. What the heck is she drawing then? There's nothing interesting here. Out of the way. You're blocking my view. Move. Huh? Oh, sorry. Oh, what's with those funky colors? What do you want? No, uh, nothing. My bad. Smooth. Dude. How can she stand to wear that crazy outfit in this heat? And what was up with that weird drawing? I guess beauty is in the eye of the beholder? Eh. Oh well. Don't know if you guys recognize, but she was with uh, the Strega group. Summer vacation is starting to wind down. Go to first floor first. See how everyone's doing. Oh, right. Jinpei's not around again, huh? I've never seen that guy do any homework. Is he gonna be all right? Excellent question. I have a suggestion. Unlike the large shadows, it is difficult to predict where Strega will appear next. Koromaru-san said that we must be very cautious of them. By the way, it's all over the news. Apathy syndrome cases are increasing. Must do something about this. Little kitty. Cat looks carefree. Good. Hey. So, have you finished all your homework already? Yep. Huh. Wow, way to go. You're one responsible guy, Yuki. Um. Oh, is it just Bunkichi? Well, I literally have nothing to do. This machine has some peculiar quirks. Crane's claw is close to the player, so the opening and closing motions are limited. How'd you learn that? One of the employees secretly told me. Seems they already considered me a regular. Maybe we should get to know these guys here. I might learn something. You know what? Let's work here. Get some extra money. Why not? I think it says it'll raise my academics and my charm. Uh, check what can be done. While working part time. Academics and courage. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. A thousand yen is nothing to sneeze at, man. Give it all. I gave it all my working. I gave it my all working part time at the concession stand. Someone asked for recommendations, so I picked a movie that fit, fit their taste. There was a complaint about noisy customers, so I gave them a warning. Well, here's your paycheck. Thanks, man. I feel like I improved my academics and courage because of my work. Hey, look at that! 
was enough to put me over the edge. It's getting late. I should head back to the dorm. No. No means no. What's wrong? I am currently negotiating with Koromaru-san. Koromaru-san is prohibited from going out for a walk on his own. There were arrangements for Sonata-san to accompany Koromaru-san on his walk today. However, the scheduled time has passed, and Sonata-san has yet to return. Koromaru-san's patience has reached its limit. Koromaru-san is requesting that you accompany him instead. Are you available to assist at the moment? Um... Sure. You are what they call a lifesaver. Good old puppers. Koromaru and I left the dorm to go for a walk. Human persona user. Now that is certainly unique. However, my fascination lies more with you. Good evening. There's no need for hostility. Now is hardly the time. Let's have a little chat. Come along. It doesn't seem to be hostile. What should I do? What exactly are you waiting for? All right. Let's see what he's got to say. Now then, I have a question. Oh for fuck! I forgot about the shrine. Damn. However, just demanding answers from you wouldn't be a very fair arrangement, now would it? I will answer one question of your own first. So, what do you want to know? you wearing a top um what's your goal we don't serve any particular grand purpose had you simply stayed your hands we could have avoided a needless confrontation in the beginning we had no quarrel with you had you not decided to eliminate the dark hour we wouldn't have had a reason to interfere it is truly unfathomable. The power of a persona is a blessing granted only to us. Yet, you insist on ending the Dark Hour, knowing full well that your powers will be lost. Now, answer me this. Why? Are you trying to protect the world from the shadows? That's right. And just where did you come up with that idea? In this country, almost 5,000 people die in car accidents every year. And yet, there is no outcry against the existence of cars. Why do you suppose that is? It is because we value our own convenience over the lives of others. So then, why should we give up the powers we were bestowed? That logic literally makes no sense. Do you know what a savior complex is? You are being trapped by a misguided way of thinking. We have no obligation to sacrifice what is ours to save others. Yeah. Giving up your own life to save others is simply a waste. That's not your true. Your reason for fighting is one of obsession. No. You're wrong. Do you continue to deny it because you can't accept the truth? There is no need to rush your decision. You should think carefully about it. We have been given a special power. And yours... Yours is particularly extraordinary. 
It's as if the Dark Hour has chosen you. Does it really make sense for you to reject this gift? That was all I had to say. Tonight is a new moon. You have ample time to reconsider before the moon waxes full again. Folded paper. With that, my debt to you is paid. Perhaps it might help you make up your mind. Well then, I shall be going. I trust you'll have changed your tune by the next time we meet. There's some written on it. The new gear has eased summoning, but we need to make new safety cartridges before handing them off to MK. The evoker weight is also an urgent matter. Fortunately, ample test subjects remain to... I return to the dorm and report what happened. So, it's interesting uh, what uh, Takaya is uh, is basically reasoning with. Because it's true. I mean, some people would agree that he has a point. You know, in, in both cases where, you know, nobody blames... There's so many accidents in a year, and we don't really do anything about it. And uh, the Savior Complex, where, you know, why is someone else's life more important than ours just because we feel it's the right thing to do here ultimately he does have a point in terms of philosophy what is the right thing to do what is the wrong thing to do um, my opinion of something could very well differ from yours and it doesn't necessarily mean either one of us is right it's just the way we perceive how life should be um, and it ultimately you know, shows what kind of character you are. Again, there is no real right or wrong. Helping others is a great thing to do, but where's the limit? You know, would you would you give up your own life to save someone else's? A lot of people would. Some people wouldn't. Doesn't necessarily mean it's right or wrong. I mean, I personally would, but again, it, would you run into a burning building to save someone else? You say you would, but right there in the moment, would you actually do it? It's really hard to say. You'd like to think that you'd be able to do it, but... Who knows, right? Some people do. I mean, they, and they get reported in the news as that they're heroes. But you're risking your own life to do it. You could potentially... Both of you could potentially die in a, in like a, in a fire. You go in to save someone else, so you fail, and you both die. Hmm. I can't believe that Straker guy went to the shrine, too. And why was he half naked? Is it because it's summer? Hello. One of the members of Strega seems to have taken an interest in you. Sometimes a malicious human can be more dangerous than a shadow. If we should cross paths, I want you to be careful. So that paper that he gave us... Strip of paper from Takaya, seemingly part of some research material. <sighs> Excuse me. Um, interesting what was written on there, right? What's up? Pet brushes at Koromaru's feet. I wonder if he means if this means he wants me to brush him. Uh, not now. Just give me a minute, man. You're almost done reading that sci-fi novel, right? You want to read together? Yeah. Sorry, Karamaro. <laughs> I was hoping we could have a little discussion after you finish reading it. Absolutely. All right. Uh, 
feel like my academics have improved thanks to the skillful expression in the writing. I guess our academics can go higher. I thought five was the limit. Maybe it's six. Oh, maybe it's ten. Did I don't you finish know. reading the final volume? You looked really focused when you were reading. I can definitely relate. When I got to the end, I was so absorbed that I almost forgot to breathe. What an amazing series! I didn't notice at first, but at some point I could suddenly just make sense of the complex setting. Isn't it weird how that works? It's like magic. Oh, it really does feel that way, doesn't it? They do say advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic. Maybe going in with that mindset makes sci-fi a little less intimidating. I wish I could communicate as well as the author does in this book. Remember when I told you how I recommended a book to a classmate, but she turned me down? Knowing what to say is important, but how you say it is difficult too. Before I could tell her how fascinating the story is, I was telling her how many volumes it was and that it's written by a famous author. I don't think that kind of information is going to persuade someone to read. It'll go better next time. Thanks. Maybe I'll try talking to her again. I think I'll have a lot of good things to say about this book now. It always feels nice when someone shows an interest in something you like. Even just sharing our opinions like this is so refreshing. That's why I really want to work on how I communicate things. Because if I do that, then maybe I'll get more fun moments like this. Fuka is nodding with determination. Weakness buffer. Reduces damage taken when an ally's weakness is struck. That is good. That is extremely good. Look at the time. We should probably call it a night. Um, I have some other books I can recommend, if you'd like. Absolutely. You. I hope you'll like those too. Well then, good night. All right. Team's getting stronger. Okay, so let's go to the shrine first, because I completely forgot about it. I found that website, the one about revenge, remember? I immediately thought about getting revenge on my boss, but I chickened out. I closed the tab right away. Now I'm not even sure if I had the right URL. So, is this the shrine? That's Inari. Monetary offering. Fortune. What exactly did she want me to do? So it's this one. Maybe I should pray before I go. So far, there's no sign of my prayer being answered. Maybe I'll try again later. Uh, I guess I'll offer 10,000 yen. After making an offering and praying, it feels like I've been blessed with good or intelligence. Oh, okay.
Welcome back. Next full moon will occur on September 5th. Okay. Such we have approximately two weeks until oh. our next mission. Oh, hey, Aichan. Want to go on a mission to get some ice cream? Regarding that. My records indicate that consumption of ice cream may lead to health risks that detrimental to our ability to carry our uh, carry out operations. Oh, hell no! Jeez, we're gonna ruin ice cream. Agreed. I have a suggestion. In correlation to the rise of temperatures, Junpei-san's requests are also on the rise. His requests have mainly centered around topics such as going to buy ice cream and lowering the air conditioner's temperature. If this continues, Junpei-san will become a lost cause. I will report this to Mitsuru-san at once. You do that. There's nothing interesting on the news. Hmm. I never realized how expensive clothes are. Yukari-san left one of her magazines out, so I got curious to flip through it. Some clothes look the same, but their price tags are totally different. Hmm. Trendsetters sure have it hard, don't they? Yep. Let me think. It is certainly is hot. This place, even outside of training, there's a temperature where if you don't make sure you hydrate, you'll collapse. Mm -hmm. It's so hot. I need something that's ice cold. Someone bring me ice cream, please. I mean, you're the one that's eating fucking beef ball with like hot water. Hmm. Think about putting together some food. No. Um. Nothing else going on. Friday evening again here. Courage. Um, yeah, why not? Saw many gruesome scenes, but managed to calmly defeat my enemies. Very nice. I'm now fearless. Hey, have you seen Koro-chan? He went outside. No, oh, just when I was about to brush him. Wait, is that bad? Again? He likes to step out front every so often to get some sunlight. Oh, thank goodness. Well, I guess it's not a big deal if he's just basking in the sun. Korochan would never bite or bark at people anyway. I agree with you there. However, we still have the responsibility of being his owners. I don't want to restrict his freedom too much, but we still have to be mindful. I've been getting him to come back in whenever I notice he's gone out. Try to do the same if you ever happen to see him outside. That means I have to start going outside? Come on, Karamaru. It's time to come in. Responsibility, huh? Yeah, I guess that's true. He may be a Persona user, but he is still a dog. I should see... If I see Koromaru outside, I should call out to him. Okay. I have a theory. Frequency at which the lost appear is a good measure of a shadow's strength. Casualties are currently on the rise, so we must remain ever vigilant. We can most likely expect more powerful enemies to appear in the future. Yo. Sounds like we're able to go to Tartarus tonight. 
The Mitsuru says she's gonna pass. Some kind of business she has to take care of, I guess. Going up here. Oh, there's something going on here. Maybe it's outside? Uh, front entrance? Yes. Is it hot out here? Carmora won't budge. I wonder if there's a reason he wants to stay out here. Maybe I can find out why if I spend time with Koromaru. Um, not now. Let me go to the shrine first. Because I think I don't need to stay there the whole day. I think I just need to visit it. Yeah, I think I just need to do that. Alright, let's spend time for tomorrow. Koromaru is eagerly watching all the people pass by. Oh, is that you there, Koromaru? Do you remember me? I used to play shogi with the priest. Oh, I see, I see. Oh, dear. I'm sorry, but do you mind if I rest here for a bit? Uh, want to rest inside? Oh, no, no. Here's fine. Down we go. <laughs> Years are catching up to me. Do you live here? In that case, I have to give you my thanks. So thank you for taking Koromaru in as your family. A lot's been going on ever since the priest's accident. To tell you the truth, someone else was willing to take Koromaru in. Uh, but he was always at the shrine. That's right. We eventually realized that Koromaru kept going back to the shrine. I'm not sure what it was, but it seemed like he had some unfinished business. And after that, no one else was able to take him in. However, if he's here now, I take it he achieved his goal then. He protected the shrine. I see. <laughs> you did well, didn't you, boy? To be honest, I don't really understand any of this. But if you do, then Koromaru must be happy. I believe that Koromaru's bright enough to choose where he wants to be. And that means it must be his choice to be here with you. Be good to each other, will you? We will. He's a good boy. All right. I've rested plenty. I'll get out of your hair before it gets too late. Oh, see, Daisy. Ow, ow, ow. Poor old man. He's hurting his back from carrying too much. Let me carry your bags. Oh, that's very sweet of you. I'd like that very much. Karamaro and I walked with the old man back to his place. Oh! <laughs> You're in a good mood, Koro-chan. Did you go for a walk? You helped? Ah, I see. 
I believe Koromaru-san wants to thank you. He says, let's do it again. What? I think Koromaru appreciates me. I feel like my charm has increased after helping people with Koromaru. Should we head in? It's almost Koro-chan's dinner time. I'll be preparing your dinner today, Koromaru-san. I hope you look forward to it. I guess that's a no. We headed to the dorm after Koromaru calmed down a bit. Welcome back. Greetings. I would like to ask you a question. Why do schools temporarily close during the summer? Because it's hot. It's customary. I see. Then after the allotted break period ends, school I resumes. Comprehend. Good. Wow, a lot of people yeah. interested. Uh, might get a new ability. Not now. Uh, let someone else do it. I already hung out with you today, Koromaru. Doesn't seem like he will gain any more skills even if he helps me guard. Uh, not now. I guess I'll do Sonata. Actually, hang on. Um, I'll do Sonata. Yeah. Yes. All right. Today, we're going to see some of the greatest matches the champs have ever... Hmm? And here we are with the first match of the qualifiers. In the red corner, we have Akihiko Sonata-kun from Gekko-kan High it's School. Me. This is footage from my first official match. My coach from back then recorded it for me. Uh, sorry, looks like I put on the wrong video. Uh, let me switch it out. I want to see this. Hey, come on. It's not that interesting. But I guess this might be a good opportunity. Uh, let's watch it. Uh, I look so stiff and nervous. My form is all over the place. Uh, how did I even win this? At least I can tell I've improved since then. Here's where I get my life straight in. And the winner is Sonata Kun <laughs> from Check the out my red face. corner. I'm trying to look calm, but on the inside, I can barely contain myself. I know I said before that I just wanted to learn how to fight with my bare hands, but this might actually be why I stuck with boxing. I won in like 11 seconds. That's fucking crazy, man. I'm, I'm sure some time has passed, but still. This victory gave me confidence. I wasn't so stiff in any of my later matches. Are you the type to get nervous in front of a bunch of people like that? Not really. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. You're just as reliable as a leader ought to be. If you ever want to try getting in the ring, I'd be glad to have you. I've learned a lot from boxing, but there's a strict rule I follow when it comes to winning. Find your opportunity, then strike without hesitation. It's easy enough to remember, but hard to apply. You could say the same thing about fighting shadows, too. I've always tried to keep those words in mind, but now I'll be even more conscious of them. So now it seems to have found new potential within himself after watching the DVD. Let's see what he's got. Buff amp greatly increases the side effects of buffs on self. Cool. You know, I never thought you'd see me like that. But it did help remind me how I felt when I was starting out. Anyway, sorry you had to sit through that. I'll save the champion matches for next time. I feel like my courage has improved. Now we move on to round two of the qualifiers. In the red corner, Akihiko Sonata oh, well. from Gekko Kan High School. 
Wanna watch some more before we go to sleep? It's almost time for the home shopping show. It's amazing! Co I'm gonna I'm do going it! I'm gonna do it! Alright. Good, good. Soul spinach, and you get two of them. Oh my goodness, it's wonderful. But wait, there's more. Not bad, kid. A sprout potato. Mm. How many days say we get? We get two? No, I don't think we need it. I think we're Thanks, okay. kid. Bye bye. Bye. Okay, we're most likely gonna finish off Maya's thing today. Just want to talk to people. Excuse me. Seems to be a theory that summer vacation is a measure to protect students from the heat. Despite this, school will resume in September. Temperature on August 1st was 29 degrees Celsius. Forecast for September 1st is 31 degrees Celsius. I have a suggestion. Would it not make more sense for summer vacation to be implemented until October? If only. Um, hey. Number of people falling victim to shadows is increasing again. We have to defeat the remaining four shadows no matter what. We will. Hmm? That, Junpei, talking nonsense again. Did he finally finish off his final brain cells? Eh, I guess I'll just leave him alone. Well, what do you say? Yeah. There are all kinds of people out here, huh? Those, you know those gothic will lead us, right? They still dress themselves up from head to toe in frills. And even in this heat. I saw one drawing all this weird art in, no in a notebook. Nah. Felt like she was living in a different world, dude. By the way. Summer vacation is almost over, but I still have some homework left to do. I'll get back to it after a short break. Hey then. Let's go to the shrine. Oh, that guy's there now, yeah. So we definitely want to talk to him. He's only here on Sundays. Air around me has shifted. There's an unfamiliar scrap of paper in my pocket. Upon closer inspection, it looks like an old bill. It says 500 yen. It looks like my prayers were answered. I should let Elizabeth know. Um, we'll talk to him next time because, again, I want to finish off Maya's uh, thing. My request. Wonderful. Seems you've completed a request. One moment, please, while I check. Oh, what's this? I sense strange power emanating from that bill. I thought it would have taken months and years to complete the hundred shrine <laughs> visit. But perhaps it's not the number of visits that matters, but the strength of your wish. Please take this as your reward. Thank you. Nothing new, right? Cool. Nope. Very well then. Good day. What? Do you mind escorting me yet again? This time I would like to go to a location known as Naganaki Shrine. I shall be waiting then. If you have the time, then please come fetch me, so long as the sun is out. Um. Sure. Here are my requests. Let's go now. I've been waiting for you. I've been waiting for you to ask. Shall we be on our way? So this is a shrine. It's quite similar to a temple, is it not? A mysterious presence lurks here, though it is markedly different from a shadow. Well then, I shall first observe the local traditions and pay my respects.
I wonder if this is enough. It's too much. Is there a problem? I'd heard that the effects of this mystical divine grace were proportional to the amount offered. Yeah, funny In how that event, works, isn't I it? I have finished presenting my offering. Come to think of it, this system of monetary offerings is very similar to that of the fountain. There are a great many locations in your world where supplicants may request good fortune. You live in a truly wondrous place. Could those paper strips tied there be... Just as I thought, these are paper fortunes. I've heard of this game. People entrust their destiny to a slip of paper, finding the risk far too exhilarating. I see. There are many possible destinies written on them. Well then, I'd like to experiment with this for myself. Please wait here while I work on obtaining every single variation. I decided to wait until Elizabeth is satisfied. Excuse me. I've been curious ever since we arrived. But what is that equipment over there? If memory serves, these are a slide and a jungle gem, correct? I see. In the presence of a true god, upholding a pretense of gravitas is all but meaningless. What a magnanimous and introspective message. If that is the case... <laughs> Fascinating. In order to attain joy, one must first claw one's way to the very top. This playground equipment teaches a profound lesson on the true way of the world. I agree. Well, that was certainly entertaining. Now, could you please instruct me in the proper use of the jungle gem over here? Just climb it. Or you can get stuck in the middle of it. Sure. I can't get out. Oh dear, it's rather difficult to maintain one's balance. Today was even more enjoyable than our other outings thus far. Hmm. To be honest, lately I've been wondering, do I find this world enjoyable simply because of the novelty of the stimuli it presents? Or another possibility, perhaps I enjoy myself on these excursions because of your company. Aww. In any event, I believe I'll have to negotiate with my master to install a horizontal bar in our room. I'd like for you to accompany me again sometime, if you wouldn't mind. Sure. Well then, I suppose we should call it a day. But before we do, I'd like to go on the slide one more time. Shall we seize I the opportunity it. and go in tandem? Woo! Woo! After Elizabeth had her fun, we headed back to the Velvet Room together. Here are my requests. Wonderful. I want my reward. Thank you for showing me around Naganaki Shrine. I must say that the harmony between religion and recreation was indeed superb. Come to think of it. I'm currently in negotiations with my master about introducing a set of horizontal bars in our room. If I should win this favor, please stop by to make use of them. Vitality Sash. Very well. What does that do? Plus 50 HP. A sash like the Samurai War. Kindles immense vitality. What am I currently wearing? All stats plus three. Cool, cool. Um, 
Yes. Forgot what I was gonna do. And actually, we haven't saved in a while, have we? Oops. Guru. Oh, Maya. Oh, come on. Oh, because I don't have the... No, no. Did I get rid of it? What's her thing again? Might have uh, used it or gotten rid of it earlier. Welcome to the Velvet Room. This is your progress so far. Naga, nah, I'm pretty sure I got rid of it. Please take a look. You know what? Let me see. Well then, shall we take a look? Lamia. Seeing what personas come to be is a great joy of mine. Um... Sure. Are you satisfied with this? Yeah. What do you wish to inherit? Wow, we got a lot of stuff, eh? Okay. High chance of charm. Um. Guess I'll take this one. We don't need that. We don't need that. Increase evasion against slash skills. Counter. Regenerate. I'll take regenerate. Charm boosts. Have the chance of taking critical hits. And growth. Oh, we'll take it appears two. it will receive a. It's finally time. I shall turn the flames of vengeance into a fiery force for you to wield. God, who knew my personas were so hot? Seems the Hermit's social link has blessed you with even more power. Okay, poison mist. Is this medium? Yeah, that's okay. Soul Sea Triplets. Okay. Very well. All right, Maya, I'm a coming. Oh, come on. That's bullshit. Oh, uh, one more Sunday. Or we could talk to that dude. Hello. Oh, I didn't know you were already here. As you can see, I've come over for a quick visit. Mm, the pattern stays consistent, then our cases of apathy syndrome will soon be on the rise. It's a shame, since it's your summer vacation. But the shadows don't take breaks. Mm. Yes, what's the matter? Oh, you think that I don't, know, I don't know anything about fashion because I'm a researcher, right? Uh, not at all. Yes. Good. You know that it's not a prudent to judge a person based on preconceptions. Yes. 
He wants to go for a walk. You want to plant. And they want to read. Um. Oh, right. Sparring Tartarus and defeating shadows are both important. So is doing summer homework. In fact, doing homework may be even more of a priority because of the due date. Exactly. Did you get that, Junpei? Of course I did. Who do you think I am? Alright, you got me. I haven't even started. No, don't. Stop. Don't look at me with such disappointment in your eyes. All right. Homework is insignificant compared to Tartarus. We must unlock our hidden potential to, to defeat the evil shadows. Yes, we have an important mission. Huh? I think homework is also an important mission. Yeah. Yeah, and I'm sure Senpai would agree. Well said. Jeez. Junpei hasn't even touched his homework. He keeps saying that he wants to go to Tartarus instead. Talk about escapism. Indeed. Alright. Um, I guess let's plant. Mm. By tending to your hide... By tending to a garden to high temperature conditions, you may be able to achieve whatever she said. Yes, yes, yes. I'm ready to deploy at any time. Let's do the soul spinach. Yes. It appears they are growing well. Hip hip hooray, as they say. The ladybug has grown into a fine adult as well. I believe this is mission complete. Well done. Thanks for your help. I tried to do everything in my power. I'm glad I was of service. The ladybug put in a lot of work as well. We thank you for your service. I've realized something, tending these plants alongside you. I've made many new discoveries beside these planters. Everyone is doing the best they can to make their way in the world. That goes for the plants, and the pests, and the ladybug too, and you as well. I may be a machine, but I also want to do the best I can. I will do my best to make my way in the world, just like everyone else. That is my new goal from now on. Uh, I won't let you beat me. I am impressed. I hadn't expected a competition here. Hearing that, my motivation is fully charged, as they say. I guess seems to have found a new purpose through tending the plants. Oh, hey! Physical boost strengthens physical skills. I'll take it, I'll take it. Naturally, I will still continue to look after them at full throttle. Let's get started right away. Tended the plants with I guess. Looks like they're growing they're going to grow nicely. Once again, our mission has concluded without incident today. Let's head back now. You know what's been on my mind a lot? Whenever she like bends down and kinda like angles herself forward, how does she balance herself? Because she has no feet. <sighs> you just don't know when to give up, do ya? I'll come back as many times as I need to. I don't give up that easy. And my answer will be the same every time. I'm not going back. Actually, we got a new team member. Did you know animals can use personas too? Wait, what'd you just say? He's a dog. He lost his master to the shadows six months ago. And he's incredibly loyal, too. Up until now, he's been guarding the spot where his master was killed. It's been rough for him, but he's making the most of it. Uh. Huh? Oh, it's Sonata-san. Huh? Who's he talking to? I wouldn't want to butt in. We saw someone die right before our eyes, too. It'll be two years this October. How long are you going to beat yourself up over that? That's why you're always behind the station. Even though you don't actually hang out with anyone there. 
doesn't matter. It was my fault. Nothing's ever going to change that. What does it matter if I come to terms with it? it? Won't change the past. This isn't like it was with your sister. What happened to Miki was different. Shinji. It's over now. I just want to forget it ever happened. Two years ago? <sighs> no way. It's him. So, his name is Shinji. Some kind of drama going on. Film festival only runs for one more week. Maybe I should invite someone from the dorm to go with me. Good morning. Hey, it's another hot day. Maybe I'll just stay inside today. I was actually gonna go gonna go to the film festival with my friend, but now she says she can't go. Jeez. I was honestly looking forward to it, so it's kind of a bummer. She was interested in going to the film festival. Amada kun didn't seem well. Maybe he came down with that he with heat exhaustion like Junpei kun. Buka seems worried. That doubt she's in the mood to go to the movies. If I may speak. I'm very busy at the moment, Makoto san. You should relax during the summer vacation. That is what I was told. Thus I'm devoting all available processes to relaxation. I can seem serious, I should leave her be. Hmm. I must file a report with the Carijo group. Port Manning is tricky. I'll have to do some research. Mitsuru seems busy. I doubt she's in the mood to go to the movies. Good boy. Who's our good pop? Paramaro seems lively today. Should I invite him to go to the film festival? No. Alright, nothing going on anywhere. I guess I'm going to the film festival. You have a new burger, guys. Something for you. When was that sent? Alright, let's go to the police station real quick. I don't know if it's from today or not. Let's see if there's anyone else. Just the one. Be careful out there. All done here? Yep. Come back soon. So it was from basically probably when I saved the people from Tartarus. And he had the rewards. Alright, Ikari. Let's Good go. Morning. Huh? Huh? You want to go? Sorry, I wasn't trying to guilt you into taking me or anything. But I do hate going alone. So, yeah, let's go. The Willpower series. I was planning on seeing this with a friend from my club. I thought it might help motivate us. You might think it's kind of cheesy, though. Now I'm not so sure about this. Come on, show me some guts! Push your limits! Hot blooded sweat is run across the screen. I learned that with enough willpower, you can come in. That was our promise! I'll never forget it. I'm gonna make it! I won't stop running till I reach the Those are some sunset. nice seats, man. Oh, that was awesome. We were in there for a while, but it went by so fast. I guess there really are times in life where you gotta push yourself through with sheer willpower. But I'm still young. I haven't really done anything that crazy just yet. Oh, wow, it's getting late. How many movies did we watch? 62. We saw the baseball one, the judo one, the boot camp one. Oh, right, even shot put. The shot put stuff kind of lost me, but the scenes after that with the main guy running were so good. Oh, I cried my eyes out when he did the hundred handstands into the sunset. Uh, I'm being weird, huh? Anyway, I'm getting hungry. Why don't we grab a bite somewhere before heading back? 
Sure. Decided to go back to the dorm with Yukari. Welcome back. Hi, how was your day? Just one more week and then summer vacation will be over. We've been so busy, but I don't think I've ever had a summer vacation that was so fulfilling before. Let's keep having fun these last few days and try not to let the summer heat bother us too much. By the way, the ability of Koromaru-san's persona is part of its charm. This is most likely because Koromaru-san is fast himself. I now understand why his walks are so rigorous as well. Um. Madakun seems a bit lethargic. I wonder, could it be heat exhaustion? Since it's really hot lately? She's not gonna learn anything new. Hmm. No matter how I get how bored I get, I don't think I'll ever touch any of the books here. Not much else to do though. Well, there's that one manga I borrowed from what's his name. Um I'll pass. <laughs> I'll hang out with you, don't worry, but I want to level up Koromaru. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's watch it. It's another episode of that docu-series about a wolf pack. In this, one, in this one, a mischievous wolf pup is playing with his father. Oh, he doesn't have a dad. Koromaru seems kind of sad. Do you miss your parents? Koromaru seems fixated on the scene. His eyes hold a trace of longing. I wonder if he misses his parents. Watching animals live in the wild helped me improve my academics. I'm so smart now, guys. <laughs> Looks like there's more to the documentary series on wolves. Maybe I'll watch it with Karmara again whenever I have the time. Yeah, we should head to Tartarus sooner or later. So our vacation will be over soon. The film festival is almost over too. Maybe I should invite someone from the dorm to go with me. Um, unless I have something else to do. Yeah. Ah, Yuki, you don't look, you look bored. Not that I can claim any different, but I want to switch up my workout plan, but the heat is killing me. Seems bored. Nope. Oh yeah! All those movies were great, but more importantly, there was air conditioning. Ha, I'm just kidding. I really had fun. Thanks for inviting me. Alright. Let's go to the strip mall. He only eats leftovers from the shops. I think he's getting tired of it. Maybe I should get a saucer of milk for him. Yeah, I'm gonna go buy some milk. He'll like that, I think. It's a good idea. Yeah, you'll probably love it. When you order a pork cutlet set and there's cabbage on top, write a dollar sign on top of it, and I hear your allowance will increase. Interesting. Such a cliche for adults to complain about how young, pe young people look and act. You see articles about it all the time on what's corrupting the youth these days. But that guy kind of begs the question. I'm talking about a young man I saw on the street while doing this story. Long hair, bare upper body, tattoos on both arms. You see a person like that and it makes you wonder if the youth really are being corrupted. I mean, what else would you call it? God damn it! Alright, so... Uh, fine, maybe I'll go to the film festival. I'm 
guessing I will raise my courage. Yeah. Yo. You look bored. Did you finish your homework? Well, you're one up on Junpei. Alright. All right. Film festival, huh? I didn't know about it until Junpei told me. Come on, let's go. So today's theme is the Hidden Fist Martial Arts Series. Somehow, I get the feeling we're gonna see a lot of cliches in here. Oh well, let's check it out. You might be surprised. Red 3. This can't be. You should have already reached your limit. How are you still standing? Limits exist to be broken. Now, witness my ultimate technique! Go and T-Rex and Shinken! Final form! Ah, such an impressive ability. But it is I who shall prevail. This is so Metal Gear. Red 3 can't be. Metal Gear. Uh, okay, what did he say? The action scene continues. I cheer for the main character who pulled himself up every time he was knocked down. Is this courage? Yeah. Did you see that move? His hands were on fire. And the way he jumped so high, it looked like he was suspended from the ceiling. I guess that's why they call it wire foo, huh? Hmm. But from what I saw, I didn't really spot any specialized training. They won't give up their secrets that easily. Must be why it's called the Hidden Fist. Duh. I've got to train even harder. All right. I'm going to do squats on the monorail the whole way back. Oh, jeez. Oh, Sonata. Welcome back. Greetings. Salutations. By the way. During summer vacation, it seems students are subjected to summer homework. What I've heard, it takes a tremendous amount of mental strength to power through this. Thus, it is only natural that people cannot complete it. Or so Junpei says. Salut. I hate to say this, but the number of the losses is increasing again. They want to start getting ready for the next battle. Now that Koromaru's joined us, we want to consider devising some new tactics. Oh? It's finally the end of August. Once school starts back up again, you won't have much time for anything else. If you have anything you need to do, you better take care of it now. Uh, hmm. Uh, nope. Charm, maybe another um. time. You won't learn anything new, right? Doesn't seem like Fuka will gain any more skills. Okay. Um. Not now. Sorry. That's fine. Uh, I was planning on going to Tartarus tonight. Are you here for another life lesson? As per usual, it'll be free of charge. Sure. Hmm. I see. You're quite the honest young man. I'll give you that. So, uh, today we'll talk about... Uh, I just can't concentrate. I get so worked up when I picture his face. What happened? He really did it. He betrayed me. I won't sleep a wink tonight. There was a young man who was working for me. A hard worker who graduated from a distinguished private university. But this month he couldn't meet his sales quota. So I docked his pay. Self-confidence went down the drain. Then, just stopped coming to work. Feel sorry for him. 
What are you talking about? You should feel sorry for me. I just mailed him a letter of termination. COD. It's his fault the company's in the red this month. I've wasted so many resources. All those expenses for training, hardware, facilities, labor costs. Oh, it makes me sick just thinking about the net losses. Ugh. It's all about the money. Of course it is. I love money. Money won't betray me like he did. It's difficult growing up with no money. You can't even afford shoes for gym class, you know? Going barefoot in the winter is torture. I've been thinking. How would you like to model exclusively for my company? Your innocent appearance would be a perfect camouflage for the ugly realities of business. Think about it, will you? Join me, and you'll never have to worry about being shoeless in PE. Starting to open up to me. I understand him a little better now. We rank five, yeah. All right, what's your threat this time? Oh, better get going. Oh, we're short-staffed now, so I'll have to reevaluate the budget for next month. If I decide to hire someone new, their training is going to cost a fortune. Oh, no threat this time. Summer vacation will be over soon. Film festival is almost over too. Maybe I should invite someone. I say is down there. Good. By the way, model looks pretty down. Is it the heat or something? Kids are supposed to be in the yard playing with their dog. There's no backyard. There's no backyard here, though. Nice. Oh, but we do have a dog. We could be playing with him right now. He, oh, yeah, he seems very busy. Hmm. You could, do you have any ideas for my new workout plan? I need to figure out a way to dish out punches like the ones in the movie. So then I was thinking hard. I should leave him alone. I have a suggestion. Karamaro san has an intense desire to go somewhere. Furthermore, it appears that if he does not go today, he will not be able to go at all. Please listen to Karamaro san's request, Makoto. Uh, fine, let's go. He's very happy. I in turn am happy for Koromaru son. He couldn't wait any longer. Trying to enter the movie theater with Koromaru. It was about the theater, really? I insist that Koromaru was just a stuffed doll, but management kicked me out. Yeah, I didn't think he'd be able to go. He seems disappointed. I promised Koromaru I would buy the DVD for him when it released. I didn't want to go to the theater today. I wanted to hang out with Hayase. Oh, fuck. Whatever. Too late now. Welcome back. It really does get very hot in the dorm. Maybe it won't be so bad if we think of it like a sauna. Excuse me. Summer vacation will end soon, and school will resume session. This poses a problem. I will not be able to stay by your side when you're at school. Um, that is worrisome. What should I do? Yeah, you 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 figure it out. <sighs> There's gonna be a full moon soon after vacation ends. Prepare yourself for it. By the way. Madakun's only supposed to stay at the dorm for the summer, right? Guess that means he'll be heading home soon. 
Even though he wasn't here for very long, it's still gonna be sad to see him go. By the way, dude, Amato wasn't looking so good. I think he got heat, heat exhaustion. Poor kid. Kids his age should be outside playing. You know, have some fun, build up some stamina. Isn't that right? Just because it's hot out didn't make it a reason to skip the training. So for Tartarus, if you're gonna go, give me a shout, all right? What uh, day can I put food in here? Is it the 29th? 27th, so tomorrow. Oh, hey. Well, I... I always thought there was something I had to do. The more I thought about it, the more hesitant I became. But I made up my mind. Next chance I get, I'll do it. Yes. I'll get it done for sure. Sounds like a plan. A plan, bro. Okay. Awesome. Perfect night to go to Tartarus. Um. Uh, actually. Let me save. Okay. So, next time, um, I think that's it for this episode, sorry. Um, next time we'll head into Tartarus and uh, we'll spend uh, a bit of time in there, uh, getting up to the next barrier. Because it looks like the we're, what, 10 days until the next full moon boss. So, uh, we want to make sure we're, we're prepared for that. I was, wait I was hoping to... I was waiting a little bit to see if there'd be like another person that'd be stuck in Tartarus, so I won't have to go back in there. But uh, yeah, I, I think we'll just uh, we'll just head on in. Uh, so yeah, so that's what we have uh, to look forward to the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.